My name is Ophelia Chambliss. I am an artist, an educator, a public speaker, and I live in York, Pennsylvania. I have a working studio and gallery at 251 West Market Street in York. I became connected with the History Center a number of years ago. I started doing some work um, uncovering black history in Gettysburg. And in the process of doing that, finding so many wonderful rich histories, I started working with the York County History Center, discovering a lot of their um, hidden stories in York black history. And we developed a relationship and started working on a project that really involved interviews and things like that. Art and history are extremely important to any community because those are the things we save. Those are the things that we're gonna carry into future generations where our kids, our grandkids, our great, great, great grandkids can look back and, and capture or to get a sense of what was happening then, what were people thinking, you know, where we were going and where did things go wrong, where did things go right? You know, what did my grandparents do? What do I stand for? Those are the things that are deep down that we cherish um, and being able to capture that in history centers and to capture that in art for all of time is extremely important. Um, I always tell people that if you're two years old and you cannot read, if you're 90 years old and you're functionally illiterate, or if you come from another country and you don't even read our language, we can all look at a visual image and pretty much get the same message. So art for that reason is extremely powerful and it's the sort of thing that we save and we cherish and we archive it. So one of the other surprises in putting together the timeline, which was a really wonderful point of reference for people to give them a sense of how time operates, is that Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., um, Anne Frank, and Barbara Walters were all born in the same year, but we think of them in completely different timelines. So to be able to compress all of this history into one timeline really shows us just how much we have in common and how much we are you know, walking along the same timeline.